The, uh, the short attention span of the international community is, the, is one of the biggest problems here, or if not the biggest problem. Uh, the, the, uh, that the international community needs to realize a few things, uh, and, and most importantly, that to build a state in Afghanistan, it has to be an Afghan state. It cannot be a Western, modernized uh, state and so on. Unfortunately, the whole Bonn Agreement and this, uh, the political agreement after the fall of the Taliban and so on is actually trying to put, in, to put a Western state in Afghanistan and so on. The state has to be an Afghan modern state. The future of Afghanistan will not be decided in Kabul. It will not be decided in Washington or Brussels or London or anything like that. It will be decided out in the valleys in Afghanistan. That's where 80% of the Afghan people live. If you try to reform Afghanistan too fast, you will get a discontent. You will get uh, uh, people will not like it. People will think that it's it's an, it's a violation of of their ways of life, etc., etc., and so. And that, in its turn, will will smoothen the way or, or prepare the way for for very conservative forces who will who will uh, who will use this discontent for political purposes. There is a danger that you will serve it on a golden plate to the Taliban. So what you see in international assistance today is that to quite an extent it's getting privatized. And, 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 and when the private thing is coming in, then the profit is coming in. And then the most important thing for you as, as working for a company or, or the most important thing for that company who is a subcontractor is to make a profit. And you are in an insecure area <coughs> with an uncertain political future, etc. And so, so, and then of course you are not looking long term. You you are looking short term. You go in for the quick fix, and you and the quick fix. The main purpose of the quick fix is to make as much money as possible. There was a malaria program which was run by by the U USAID here in in uh, anti malaria program in in. Uh, yeah, and it was evaluated in 2006, and I just saw the report. And the, the, uh, one of the uh, conclusions was that 5% of the money reached actually to the, to the needy people. This requires a long-term commitment and a very, say, orderly, organized, uh, 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 say, strategic commitment from the international community. You probably need to look to 30, 40, 50 years. Uh, you see, there's a famous Taliban quote, a Taliban leader who said that, you Westerners, you have your watches. We Taliban, we have the time. <laughs> and, and the thing is that we have to turn that. We have to say, okay, we're not, we do not only have our watches, we have the time too.